unemployment results in lower purchasing power. Now, if unemployment increases, instead of spending seven thousand, I'll spend only two thousand. That means my purchasing power is decreasing, which in turn causes lowered profit for the business and leads to budget cut. That means cost cutting and workforce reduction. So they cut the cost by reducing the workforce. They cut the cost by reducing the employees. It creates a cycle that goes on and on, and every one loses in the end. Now, if employee is removed, okay, purchasing power will decrease. He is not able to satisfy his basic necessities. Poverty increases. Poverty in turn reduces the growth. Growth in turn reduces the development. If the country is not developing, GDP decreases. That is, the national income decreases. If the national income decreases, okay, if there is no income, we cannot invest. we cannot save we cannot spend and this cycle goes on and on and everyone loses in the end so most of the things in macro level or most of the thing at nations level are dependent on what is the rate of unemployment in the country so if unemployment spikes up very fast or if there is more unemployment than the country then the country would be in a depression or a recession so the unemployment should be low or no for an economy to perform well 